Hey YouTube, this is Archangel for Truth, and I'm uh, once again I'm filming Venus, and as I promised, I had mentioned before on one of my other videos where I had filmed another planetary object that was close to Venus, and so uh, today I uh, was able to uh, see. Um, up in the sky here and basically uh, the object is still there but it is far far fainter than previously in fact from what I'm seeing I'm not even picking it up on my camera although I can see it with my eyes so you know uh like I said, it, it's fainter, that would suggest that it's further away. And yet, it's relatively, um, it has changed position in relation to Venus. It appears to me to be um, closer, uh, but also further back, if, if you will. So, um, if this is some sort of planetary body that is orbiting Venus, um, something that we don't know about, uh, you know, it, this is something that, uh, I'd like some sort of feedback, especially, uh, I, I want to thank you, Ronnie. I'll give you a little shout out there for your comments and encouragement, um, you know, basically uh, our desires to know what, what it is that's out there. So if it is Nibiru, Planet X, um, you know, we all just wish that NASA and the government would just, you know, tell us what we already know is, is true. So ultimately, uh, they want to engage in tactics of uh, uh, not giving all the facts out to people and that's the problem whenever you have a government that has any sort of secret organization within it you know it's it's trying to keep uh, certain facts uh, from the public that it supposedly represents but we all know the truth as regards to that but anyways so I'm sorry that my camera cannot pick this up I'm gonna zoom in and basically again because of the limitations of my camera basically it's just gonna get blurry but you know I just wanted to share this again with you because I promised that I would uh, uh, re-record yeah and so um, Let's see if the zoom, what we get with the zoom. So, here's my attempt. As you see, it's starting to... You know. So, real quick, just wanted to say, if there are any, any of you out there in the YouTube land there that uh, actually might have some camera equipment or uh, even an old telescope that you're interested in just passing on to someone who has an interest, please leave me a message and let me know how I might obtain that. Um, I'm really interested in that. Unfortunately, my circumstances are I'm currently not working, so um, my funds are very limited at, at this point. But at any rate, um, as you see, I'm trying to uh, uh, focus in on it as best as I can. So, as I pull out, maybe, oh, you can barely see it. So, if you're, you're seeing it there, it's just a barely, I'm trying to get it. It's to the left there, um, just a little bit higher than Venus. I, I don't know if you can see that little I'm trying to get it in there but at any rate 
Um, so this is my video, and like I said, I would do this. So um, like it if share it. Um, at any rate, uh, I'll pull out as far back as I can. So it's not the star that's way up there. That's something else. As I pull in, and it just so faint, especially with the sun coming out now. So that's my view, by the way, guys. So if whenever you see that dark line going across the uh, sky, um, know that it's just the telephone wire. It's no trick photography or anything like that. Nothing special. So and. I'm going to zoom in one more time, see if I can try to get this thing to pick it up. Yep. Yeah, not, not doing it, unfortunately. Anyways, I um, hope you like this, and take care, guys. Talk to you later. Almost, it almost, it wants to come in, but it doesn't. See that little white thing up to the left corner there of Venus? It, it's just so faint in relation to Venus, but... And if you watch this video, and you compare it to the others I've produced, uh, you can see the, the position is distinctly different from, um, ooh, it almost came in. Well, alright guys, uh, take care.